So today I started my day with a meditation as I hope to do every day, but the truth is I sometimes forget and I'm sometimes too busy. And I could feel myself getting edgy, so I knew I needed a really good meditation this morning, so that's what I did. And I wanted to share with you, even if you don't have a meditation practice, why it is so critical for you to take even five, 10 minutes a day, if possible, to regulate your stress. So we've all heard about our stress hormones, adrenaline and cortisol. Well, high levels of cortisol have been linked to all sorts of neurodegenerative diseases, inflammation in the body, even hippocampal damage, which is linked now to Alzheimer's. So it stands to reason that you would want to lower your cortisol levels. And I've actually had some psychologists and psychiatrists tell me that is not possible to do this. And what I wanted to share with you today is that it is. So this study comes out of Thailand and it was done in 2013. You can find this study on PubMed and the name of the study is called The Effects of Mindfulness Meditation on Serum Cortisol of Medical Students. And what this study discovered was that just after four days of mindfulness meditation, all of these students showed significant decrease in their serum cortisol, which before was believed not possible. So it stands to reason that if you could apply meditation to serum cortisol levels and lower your risk of chronic stress, inflammation, neurodegenerative diseases, why wouldn't you do that? So I just wanted this to be a reminder as much to you as it is to me, because sometimes I need my own reminders, that five to 10 minutes a day can make all the difference in the world, not just to the tone of your day, but to the tone of your physiological well-being and your future and really the quality of your life. So maybe today find five, 10 minutes and um, I'll share with you next time some more juicy studies so that you can bolster your meditation practice or create one if you don't even have one.